Okay, this is my favorite part of Live Binder because this means that you do not need a flash drive or anything to do your documents. Since we are a Google district, what I recommend you do is you have a folder that is totally dedicated in your Google Drive for invest. Everything I do from the beginning of the year till it's time to be appraised is for invest. So I have a special invest folder. So as you all know, documents have links. Anything that I make, I make it to where only people can view it and I can edit. So whoever my appraiser is or whoever wants to see it can only look at what's going on. So, for example, we're going to look at the live burner, and just for right now, we're just going to put something in. There's a section that says enter URL, okay? No matter what tab you go to, it's going to start saying enter URL. Let's say I want to put in my professional development login that is uploaded in that edited, by, uh, edited folder in the tab. So, since this is mine, I can type on it whatever I want. Test document. And then I can put how many hours and so on and so forth. Eight hours. I can put it in another one. Um, test. Two hours. If you scroll down, you'll see that it automatically adds up. No problem. Type your name, signature, and you keep it moving. Okay? So. I'm going to want to put this link in into my binder. I'm going to click share. When I click share, I'm going to click on the copy link to where anyone in the district can at least view it if they have the link or access to the binder. So all I got to do is click copy link. The link is copied. Going back to my binder, I'm going to paste. Right click paste or control V. Then I'm going to click insert. So now what everybody sees is my log if they have access to the link. Notice if you look back at the log, test document and test are here, it is still in the binder. And just for laughs and giggles, if I want to add something within my live binder that I'm editing, Let's say I'm adding, I don't know, hours. And I got six hours for that. Again, you scroll down, it's already added. Eight plus two plus six should be 16. I did it in here. If I want to see it in, in my actual Google Drive account, it's there. Vice versa. Test two, four hours. Scroll down. I've got 20 hours total. Is it in my live binder? It appears. I don't have to do anything. I can work within my edited live binder document or I can work in my edited uh, document in the Google Drive. I do not have to mess with anything. You can do this with Google Slides. You can do this with Google Docs. Again, I would make everything where they can view it, going back to the document, where they can view or make a comment. View or comment. Do not give anybody the power to edit. If you give somebody the power to edit, your document will be changed. Once you do this the first time, all you have to do is work within your Google Drive or work within your edited live binder. It is that simple.